I think what the 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 how, how Evil Mia looks is so awesome, and it's just like immediately iconic to me. Like, I don't know why. I just I, I've never seen it before. Like this girl in a slip with all the thorn cuts, and like the burns. It looks. I mean, it's scary as hell, but it's sort of amazing. So that took forever. It was like a long process, a long, like so many steps and layers and layers and layers. Good morning. I'm in the van. I'm in our VW minivan on the way to work. Today, I'm going to take you through the steps of becoming Mia on the Evil Dead. Is this for me ripping my hand off today? Yes. Oh, is it new? Oh. Ugh, look at all these pieces of like sashimi. Sashimi arm. Here I am in makeup with Claire, makeup artist extraordinaire. She's the one who makes me look beautiful. She makes me feel really good about myself. See, I come into the trailer feeling ugly, and then I leave looking like this, and I feel beautiful, you know? So an important step in becoming Blood Mia, Blood Rain Mia, is my abomination burns. So this is going to be one of the handprints, which essentially goes on like a temporary tattoo. I mean, it's pretty gross. It's definitely a burn. But I sort of think of it as like a pizza burn. <laughs> you ta-da! Da -da 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 -da. It's pretty nasty. And in a little bit, Claire will put in some third degree, which makes it shiny, and some pus. Yeah, that's a pretty girl. Um, this is why everyone dreams of being an actress. I love these pics. Cry baby, crying blood tears. So maybe I'll tell you some more stories. Up here, we have a picture, and that was the swimming through the, through the swamp day. That was at the point when I thought this movie was fun. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> kind of. What do we have here? Grime dirt. Blend mouth blood. Mm, those are all the other different kinds of blood we have. Blood, 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 blood. Blood, 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 blood. This is the makeup I'm getting in today. This is probably the most difficult process. I mean, like, um, Evil Me is a longer process, but the blood, getting it just right, it's, it's like, I come in here and get the first layer. Then I go into the hot tent on set and I get the next layer. Then, when they call for final checks, we do more blood, then I pour blood over my head, and then we do more blood. Right? Okay. Matt tells me it's time to go to set. Here is, I think this is Lou's face, right? Hmm, maybe. Here's some like juicy body parts. That's Jess, playing Olivia. Um, oh, this is me. Oh, it's heavy. That's me. Yeah, that was fun to make. Mm. Eric. That's Lou Taylor Pucci's face. I think that's Lou Taylor Pucci's chest. No idea who this is. Um, who are you? No idea. Oh, well, good to go. Gotta go. Who is this green person? Okay, there's a couple faces that I don't know. I don't know who they are. And now we are going to set. Can I hand it to you? Okay, stand by, Nice and quiet, thank you. Camera to one. Here we go. Sorry. That's okay. Really. 
Yeah. They're longer on the first leg. Okay. Set. You just missed my temper tra tantrum. Thank God. I just hate the blood rain. I become <laughs> a child. But it's okay, I'm not gonna die. Uh, see you later. I think that he's always ready to go. He's a sport and there's nothing that he's gonna say like no. He's gonna ask for more in every take. Like if and it doesn't matter what happens to the characters, he's really ready to take it and and to do another take and really keep going for it. I'm trying things. I'm I'm trying things out in this movie, and there's a lot of space, and there's a lot of like, it, it's a really safe movie to be able to try things, I think. I'm a recovering drug addict, and I'm becoming possessed. I don't think anything's too crazy, <laughs> so why not really go there, you know? Some takes I'll, I'll be as crazy as I possibly can, and Fede will say, well, let's bring it back. And for this one, Jane, instead of don't scream at them over your shoulder. Just like on action, you just turn around completely so we can see your wounds and all the cuts and all the scratches that are on your body. You might as well just, th this is the space to give everything you have. Um, so I've been, I've been trying to do that and it's exhausting. <laughs> Southside. Fucking scary. Southside. Stay there, Jane. Stay where you are. We have a shot that, of course, it's not the whole thing in the movie because it, the movie will be three hours long. But, but we had a day of just Jane going bananas in the cellar, and we just put the camera there, zooming in on her as she goes crazy and she tries different things and different <coughs> things that the demon is going. It's just like we have a sneak peek of what's going on in the cellar with Mia. I think the shot is probably five minutes long and, and she, she doesn't stop until the end, probably in the minute five, she goes like, please, can we cut? Okay. <laughs> and that's the beauty of working with her on this movie. Right? Like really, really, that was a real pleasure working with her because she will always have ideas and she will never run out of ideas like to you know to put something new in the character to do it in a different way usually she was very worried about not doing anything cliche she didn't want to do anything cliche so every time if the obvious choice was this one she would do everything she could to go the other direction right and uh that and you can i think you can really see that shower time life at work consists of many showers this is what it looks like after I shower. Sort of like murder scene, you know? Yeah, that's me. Time to say goodbye. Thanks for coming with me today. Ciao.